Do you like logic? How about analysis? Well, with this little guy, you can do both. It's called a logic analyzer, and it helps us navigate that murky world where software meets hardware. You've got ones and zeros flying out of ports every which way. We have to know what's in between those ports. What is the message? And we can solve that problem with this. So we're going to figure out what this is, how to use it, why it's useful, and why you might want one. If you want to follow along with the video, you're going to need three pieces of hardware. The first one, the subject of the video, is the Keyes USB Logic Analyzer. It's about $14, at least right now, on Amazon. The second one is the Arduino Uno for about $30. And the third one, just some jumper wires, which you may already have lying around. It probably came with your Arduino. If not, you can get a couple hundred mail-to-mail -mail wires for about $7. And your USB Logic Analyzer should come with female to female wires. So you really just need the male to male. I'll leave a link in the description to each of these products as an Amazon associate. I earn from qualifying purchases. So say you have an Arduino and you have the simplest program possible going where you set up serial and you just print hello world every two seconds. So if you flash it to the board here and go to the serial monitor, you can see it. Now, how are we seeing that? Who knows, honestly, it's coming over the USB cable somehow right here, universal serial bus. But what if we're not connected to a computer? What if this is out in the field somewhere, if you will, and we don't have a lovely little emulated terminal here to show us what the serial output is? What if we need to tap directly in to these two ports here, TX and RX, and see what's going on and see what's coming out of them? You can use an oscilloscope to view waves, analog signals, but our logic analyzer is for digital signals, which is what we're going to see coming out of a serial port. So let's try that out. So we'll plug the Arduino into the computer via USB. We'll do the same with the logic analyzer. We'll take this female to female jumper, plug it into channel one. And then we'll take this male to male jumper, plug it into that one. And the other side will go to the TX port or pin one on the right hand side of the Arduino. With that connected, we're all set to do some logic analyzing. So if we open up our logic analyzer software that came with the device, we can see it looking for the device. And here we go. We have all of our channels available. And we know it's already outputting that over serial. So we just have to hit start to start recording. And I got an error. So I'll just lower the sample rate like it wants me to. And then we'll hit start. There we go. We see it fly by. There it goes. There it goes. There it goes. So we can stop it and zoom out a bit. And it tells us how far between these messages. And if we zoom in, I actually already had this set up as ASCII. So you can see the exact moment that the signal changes for all of these letters. And it automatically divides out what each one is in binary. So you can see the data here and exactly when it starts and stops. And it's set as serial. If we change it to hexadecimal, we can see it in that way as well, in case it's not letters that we're looking at. We can see it in the terminal. Pretty cool. Thanks for watching this video. Hopefully you learned something about logic analyzers and consider maybe subscribing.